Hello everyone, welcome to another episode. <laughs> Damn, messing up on this one. Anyway, welcome to another episode. Um, I wanted to try these calls like for like during nighttime or whatever. So anyway, we're gonna start this episode off because uh, from the last episode, I was using um, especially this crown vic, and the light was just way too bright for the day. So let's see how it is gonna be during nighttime because it's it. I I think it kind of looked different during night. So. Anyway, let's see how this episode is gonna turn out, man. Um, I am using RCMP again. Um, since I don't know, I feel like I didn't do that much during the first episode, so let's try to do another one. Let's just finish up with it, and hopefully you guys gonna enjoy this, man. All right, so we're just gonna do regular traffic stop, answer some calls, you know, do the regular um police work. So. Hopefully this episode is gonna be another fun one because the last one was definitely great. We had a shootout at the last minute, but everything just went out of proportion at the last minute, so I just had to cut it or whatever. Oh, we got an officer in trouble. All right, so this is our first call for the night. Damn, we got an officer in trouble, so you know it's definitely gonna be a shootout. So, all right, so where is it? All right, right over there. All right, hopefully he's still alive though, because whenever they call for an officer in trouble like that. They already got shot or we just making it to the scene while they still trying to survive. So let's try to get there as fast as we can. Whenever they give us a call like that, um, we're trying to get there as fast as we can. So let me see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, come on, dude. Damn. You all right, right? You all right? I got an officer that need my help right now, man. You be all right. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh shoot, he didn't make it. All right, so we got a shooter. We got just one shooter. I'm gonna try to approach her at least. So she won't, I mean, she wasn't shooting at me, but she did shoot the officer though. I have auto okay to shoot her right now, but I'm gonna try to arrest her. She's definitely gonna do some time for shooting an officer. But I really can't prove if she was the one that shot the officer or whatever, because there's two other lady. Oh, there's another one. Hopefully, she's not gonna start shooting at me. She just stand up too. Come on, just don't shoot me, lady. Wow, we found a weapon, huh? All right, so let me try to hurry up and get to the other one. At least while she's carrying her weapon, I really don't trust her right now. What are you doing? Don't do it. Don't do it. Just okay. She's cooperating. Oh, I thought she was gonna pull out her gun. I almost got trigger happy for a second. I was gonna start shooting. All right, so we got the second. Um, we got the second suspect. Um, she's definitely under arrest too. But I'm calling the corner because we got an officer down and one suspect down. So, of course she had a weapon. All right, so just turn around, miss, and you are under arrest, of course. All right, so we're gonna take it to the station, of course. And um, I did not arrest the other lady yet, so I'm gonna keep going with that. All right, so she's definitely under arrest. I could tell if she got killed by some sort of assault rifle. Yeah, she got killed by an AK, of course. All right, miss, put your hands up. You are under arrest. You better hope you wasn't the one. But she looked like she was the one that was closer to him, though. Damn, I should have investigated some more. Which way was he leaning? Yeah, uh, you know what? He looked like he fell down to like, like as if he was looking at her. So I think she was the shooter, but I don't know. I wish we could do like some more investigation and stuff like that. To when you get to the scene, Fuck, you get to attack. pick. You know what? I should have done that when I got here. But anyway, that was my fault. But it looked like the officer, the way he fell down, like straight. Um. Like facing this lady, so it looked like she got shot by this lady, not the other one that was closer to him. This is me just saying. Probably gonna have to get forensic and all that stuff, but anyway, this is just a game. So, let's just get out of here and do the regular GTA stuff. Um, you know what? We could go this way. Get out the way. All right, so let's bring these ladies to the um, station. Why are they stopping over here? 
You know what? I actually try. I never try to trap. You know, I did once, but it was somebody else driving. They call. You know, what? let's do a traffic stop on the corner. I actually never did a traffic stop on them like that. And it's actually them driving right now, too. Come on, can you let me pass at least? Alright, you know what? Let's do the traffic stop. I was going to ignore the traffic stop, but you know what? Let's do the traffic stop on them and see. But anyway, I'm not going to give them no citation. I just want to see if it's going to work and if they will cooperate and not act up with me. I think the boys downtown will like you. All right, so let's check. Reach for your ID. Slowly. Yeah, I don't know why I always wanted to stop them, but anyway. All right, anyway, I'm just gonna <laughs> give them a warning. I'm not gonna give them no ticket or anything like that. <clears throat> All right, so we're gonna try to bring them to the station at least. Like, come on, just move out my way. And I see you guys are enjoying this last episode that I just post online, so... And I see you guys are already saying more um, RCMP. <laughs> it's actually fun using a vehicle, because look at the, how nice the light... I mean, the lights actually look at night, so... Definitely. I would definitely keep using them, though. But this, this was actually my first time trying a vehicle, and I think they look really nice, though. Alright. Okay, so this guy's gonna pick them up. Oh, I knew I forgot to change something. All right, it still have like this NYPD officer as the security guard or whatever. <laughs> but anyway, as long as it works, right? Really? Oh, you're gonna be scared tonight. All right, so back on patrol, of course. Are you free for an assault? Why not? Let's pick it up. Yeah, I did get a chance to do like Florida Highway Patrol and I did a RCMP and I see you guys are already asking for more, but definitely. But I have so many episodes coming out this weekend because I've been lacking this week. Because I really didn't have that much time, especially with work and I've, basically I've been busy. So I got a little free time now, so I got to work on a bunch of episodes. Involving a hit and run. Right now, I'm going for a car, so that's why I'm not stopping for anything else. Oh, um, you guys didn't see that? I can't believe I just lost control. All right, the I was trying to break, but the car was—I mean, the car was not working at all. Like, I just swam into this Ferrari. All right, but you guys didn't see that? Thank God, this is GTA, of course. All right, so we're gonna try to get to this location, which I've been trying to get to for the longest right now. Where are they? Are they in here? Oh, they might be under that bridge. Down. Oh. I'm surprised they be giving us like calls down there though. All right, you know what? Let me just back up and just drive right in here. Yeah, we're gonna drive right in here. Let's go right across. Okay. And. Yeah, I think it's down here. I'm trying to turn on my bright, on my high beam and stuff. All right, where are they? Where are you? Oh, there they go. <laughs> these two guys fighting. All right, we're gonna taste these guys, man. Hopefully, they don't cooperate after they after being tased. Oh, I got one. I got one. Oh, I got two. I got both of them now. All right, damn, they still not cooperating. All right, whenever you tase them like that and they not cooperating, so you have to keep taking. Oh my god, guys, come on! I can't even see y'all. Oh damn, he's get he's getting fucked up. Come on, let him. Oh damn, my fault, my fault. Oh, you trying to hit me too? Come on, more charge for you. Oh, this guy fell down though. Damn, the other guy's running. All right, you see, I have to. Ooh. Oh my god, he's falling now, he's falling now. Oh, damn. Alright, both of them are falling now. Alright, they will cooperate soon anyway, but I just have to... I know this is so unrealistic, but I have to keep doing this in order for them to cooperate. What the hell was that noise? Alright, there you go. He's cooperating, so I get to go after the other guy right now. 
All right, and I got so many more like episodes and stuff like that coming up. Um, I have like a 1990 episode. I was gonna try to do the Highway Patrol, but the Highway Patrol vehicle for some reason was not modded properly. Whoever made it, they probably didn't take their time. So whenever I'm trying to use it, it's like missing a part and stuff. So I'm probably just gonna do a regular patrol, like a regular patrol and for like using the 90s and stuff like that. I was just gonna plan on doing like a throwback Thursday, just like you guys mentioned to me. But we just, I don't know. I really don't know when I'm gonna be able to post videos again. So that's why whenever I get a chance, I post at least three, four videos like today. I know I'm gonna be posting a lot. So I'm trying to let at least do them and post it for you guys. So. After I edit this, I should be able to post it anytime soon. And if you guys hear so much noise on the background because I have friends over, I have a lot of people over right now and somebody watching me in the back too. So right now, let's just bring this guy to our vehicle and the other guy is cooperating. So we already stopped them. So he should just stay where he's at, like stay put. All right. So put your hands up, buddy. All right, so he's definitely under arrest. Yeah, and it was actually fun making all these episodes because it's been a while since I, like, I have so many copies of GTA. Like, I have a copy for each mod that I'm using. I have one for F at, um, FHP. If you guys wonder about the model, I actually took my time and actually just edit the, um, the, the peds and stuff like that. And, whoa, what the hell? Okay. But anyway, you're under arrest. I got the... All right, so we're gonna bring this guy to our vehicle right now, okay? I thought that wasn't working. Yeah, and Fan Con, man, you just a freaking genius. Cause I mean, I was just getting ready for GTA 5. I mean, I I know we all getting ready for GTA 5, but he's making GTA 4 so much more fun now that I don't know. In LCPDFR, I've been updating the files like more often now. Um, if you guys haven't got 1.1, definitely go get it and make sure to leave your, um, preloaded, um, what is that? Um, oh, I was just putting myself not available. Wait, it has actually showed a high beam. Whoever, oh, no, 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 it doesn't show it. All right. I have my high beam on, but I thought it was like showing the high beam, but definitely the interior of this car is definitely nice though. Yeah, so um, LCPDFR even update all these stuff, and uh, FanCon been coming up with great, great freaking great mods. Um, what else? Uh, it just I don't know. It's like the more, the more you can get um, LCPDFR to be stable, the more you will definitely enjoy this game. It's all about playing around with the settings. Don't just follow the settings that was given to you because that person that probably made it. Probably had a different um, computer than you, and all probably a different graphic card. And most of these mods work differently with different computers. So it just depends on how to get it to synchronize with your computer. So it all depends on okay, that settings might work. Let's say like right now, my the way my graphic um, look, that settings for Cry EMB might work for me, but it might not work for you. So you just gotta work with what you have or play around with it until you get the proper settings. And uh, it takes time. So if you're not a patient person, I would advise you not to try modding. <laughs> it's probably not for you because it it will this game will crash. This game will piss you off. This game got me to a point that I almost cracked the disc, which I would have been pissed right now if I did. <laughs> I got to the point that I threw the disc on the floor. Already. I don't know what like this this the this, my copy of GTA been through a lot. All right, so we just switch up the vehicle right now, and right now we are using this nice freaking Taurus. Two people fighting again? No, I'm not gonna pick that up. Yeah, so my this been like it's been through a lot. Even my um, the Ballad of Gay Tony or whatever that copy, man, this copy has been like it's been through a lot. And I know they're not even selling the disc anymore. You probably will find it on eBay or something like that. They're not in store. Okay, we got an armed suspect. Let's pick that up. All right, so we got an armed suspect. We're just going to go for it right now. And don't mind the noise in the back. It's people moving around. and We have people cooking. We have so much stuff going on right now. All right, so let's go for this um, car. 
got an armed suspect, and I'm not following the GPS. I don't know why. And I bet I'm going to end up find, finding them anyway. Yeah, but hopefully you guys been enjoying, like, LCPDFR, man. Thank you for all the supports, because um, without you guys, I won't be this far. So, definitely got to take my time to thank you guys. Oh, my God. Damn. Whoever it is is up there, though. Damn. How can I get up there? Damn. We really can't. Oh, man. I don't want to. I don't want to scare her off and then she's going to start running like either opposite direction. Yeah, she's just walking around. It looks like a female. It might be a dude. I don't know. But in order to get up there. Oh, can we can we get up there? by? No, I think I'm going to fall. Damn. Yeah, there's no way. Nope. That's not working. Can we get up there by jumping on those? Nope. I can't jump that high. Damn, yo. All right, so you know what? Let's just go around. Um, I'm gonna try to enter the highway from that exit over there. So let's try to get that as fast as we can because I don't want her to start shooting at people before we actually make it to the scene. I mean, we're already here, but I have to find a way to get up there. Stolen vehicle. Sorry. They could get away for now. Yeah, and oh, one episode that was fun because I, I actually found the this the old dispatcher from like um, GTA 2 that was freaking amazing. Cause I was like, you know, I want to make my um, I guess the 90s episode look official. Cause I did the 80. Whoa, whoa, she's right there. She's right there. All right, so we're gonna uh, try to approach her at least to talk to her. Hopefully, she's gonna talk. She's not gonna start shooting. Don't, don't, don't. Oh shit, she's she not shooting. I'm not gonna let her point that AK at me. If she does, I'm dead right now. All right, so let's just make sure we get her web. Oh my God, that Mustang! Ooh. Wow, I can't believe. Wow, that was close. That was really close. I almost got hit. Damn. Okay, that Mustang is coming back around. All right, you know what? We're gonna try to pull over this Mustang right now. All right, where is he? Is he coming our way? All right, there you go. We're going to try to pull him over at least. Come on, pull pull over, buddy. Oh, my God. The car's on fire. Dude, what what were you thinking? Get get your hands up. Get your hands up. We can't stop with AK right now. All right, put your hands up, man. Hurry up before this car blow up. All right, I called the fire department already. They should be on their way. But come on, hurry up, hurry up before your Mustang blow up right now, man. Alright, so we're going to take this guy into our vehicle and get him out of here at least. The corner is trying to get out of here too. Because this car is about to blow right now. Alright. Okay, corner. Damn, y'all didn't have to hit me like that. Alright, so I'm going to have to clear the area. I might have to use Simple Native Trainer or whatever. Damn, my car is all messed up. Alright. Damn, alright. Yeah, it's about to blow up. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, um, it's over. And everybody's gone from the vehicle anyway. All right, so let's just use Simple Native, um, Simple Native Trainer and get everything out of here. All right, that should be good. And the car disappeared too. Anyway, let me just wait for the fire, um, fire department to get here because, okay, disregard. There's just a little fire left. Oh, oh. All right, I don't think nobody should be able to hit it anymore. All right, so let's get out of here, man. Um, Yeah, that's about it. That person didn't hit it either. All right, so we clear, and let's bring this guy to the station. He almost killed me, though. He almost ran me over with that Mustang. Yeah, and as I was talking about the 19... um, I did the 1980s um, because I found a pack for the 1980s and stuff like that. And after that, I got I had a chance to put together something for the 1990s and stuff like that. I was going to do the hybrid patrol one, but the car was not that good. I guess the guy probably didn't take his time to work on the car. But I'm just going to do regular patrol. I did pick some like ELS cars and stuff like that for the 1990s. You know, the old Caprice that they used to use and stuff. 
and I made up I, I put together a little uniform which is definitely look decent look like the 90s of course and I, I don't know I think you guys gonna enjoy it because it was fun act to actually make that episode but the only thing I have to edit that video so by the time I finish with this I might have to edit it and you know do all that stuff so I usually be finished with my videos right away but the only thing that's that actually take time is you know to edit it and make sure I put it like properly for y'all all right okay so of course you know I, I had to switch up I, I wanted to use like almost all the vehicles in this episode so we'll see we got a disturbance call all right I'll take that the truck looked decent the charger looked decent the tourists look decent I'm I was just impressed by LCMP of course I never got a chance to really watch of like a full episode of them or whatever but whoever made this pack is that just this is definitely like a good pack uh, uh, how cat will say this um legit this is definitely legit man <laughs> all right so we're going for a call right now um oh it's all the way up here all right so this is wait this way all right there it go what's going on what's going on all right we got the suspect right over here uh please don't be armed i don't want to shoot you at least dude don't pull out no weapon just cooperate and i could take you to the station at least let's cooperate and if you don't have anything on you i would definitely let you go oh my god stop resisting stop resisting just don't resist come on dude you see, I didn't, I didn't even have to tase you. Like, come on. If you stop resisting, it will be easier for you right now. I can't see this guy. Where is he? Where the hell are you? Oh, my. Oh. Come here. Okay, there you go. All right, he's finally corroborating. All right, dudes. Any reason why you have to run from me right now? Do you have a weapon on you? Do you have anything that will cut me or anything like that? So... All right, so we're going to search this guy, making sure he doesn't have any weapons. So, I mean, if you have a weapon on you right now, it's better to just tell me, you know. It might be easier Update for you. Units report. A criminal resisting arrest. Suspect on resisting Sacramento arrest. Cooperation. You can go. All right, so you really don't have anything. So, um, let me do an ID check on this guy. Let me sure he doesn't have any warrants. I but, I mean... Identification, please? I mean, I, I won't arrest this guy, really. I'm going to do an ID check if he have a warrant. If he doesn't have a warrant, I'm just going to drive him out of here and just drop him off like right where we came in. Because I don't, I, I, I don't remember what this call was about though. <laughs> was it an armed suspect or whatever? I don't know. Because he's not armed. He doesn't have any weapons on him or anything like that. Suspicious. I mean... What the hell are you doing here? That's that's one of the questions right now. But anyway, you know what? Since you're cooperating, I'm going to drop the resisting. All right. So I'm just waiting on dispatch right now. All right. One citation. I had a license, which I really don't need right now. And no active warrant, which would... I mean, that's what I was looking for. So most likely, we could detain this guy, bring him to our vehicle, and place him into our vehicle. All right. So let's go. Um, I'm just going to get him out of here because this is like in the middle of nowhere. And we don't want nobody walking around here like that. So I'm just going to bring him to like to the main street and we should be out of here. What are you doing, dude? I hope you get in my car. Like if you don't. Oh, OK. OK. That's what I thought. All right. So I'm going to just bring him to the main streets and go back to patrolling, man. And of course, this car look nice. All right, so let's a traffic collision. Oh, that is way too close. Yeah, when it's close like that, it crash. I don't know why. I usually don't accept it if I'm like around the circle or too close to it, because it's just to give it give the um at, at least LCP that fall enough time to spawn the the cars and the pads and stuff like that. All right, so should we bring him to the state? You know what? Let's bring him to the station or whatever. I was gonna drop him off like right here but let's just bring him by the station or whatever and yeah just haven't did a night shift patrol like that but um it just looked decent 
and especially with these cars it definitely looked decent yeah and don't mind the background noise because i don't know what's going on over there i'm over here doing videos and stuff expire registration um you get to go right now i gotta drop off this guy and then we might switch up the car report is stolen damn you getting lucky right now you see he's stopping me from doing real police work man Anyway, let's just drop off this guy and maybe switch up the car. I'll probably keep going with this. I don't know. You guys let me know. Nah. <laughs> Somebody was requesting for me to do LCPDF 4 on Twitch. That is like, if I'm lucky, if I get like a really long episode. But if we get LCPDF 4 stable enough, because every time I get it stable, you know, they come up with a new update. Like right now we have 1.1. I got to get this one stable enough that I could just jump on the game and not have no problem. But anyway, let's close this door. All right, so switch up the car maybe. All right, so let's do the charger this time. Let's actually use the charger and see how everything's gonna go. Central to all units. Attention, all units. Illegal we street race? No. Street no, I'm not gonna. Definitely not gonna do that. No, I'm not gonna assist with that. Alright, so I, I actually picked up the shot fire one. So let's try to get to the location and. You know, whenever I get a shot fire call, I'm always ready. So tell me, I mean, tell me, most of you guys that play LCBF, when I get a, when you get a shot fire call, you always run to that call. So, I mean, that's the same way I am too. It's, I mean, does that mean we all trigger happy? I don't know. <laughs> Is it down here? No, I don't think so. Oh, there is a parking lot down there though. All right, let me just back up. So I might have to just leave the car and then go down the steps at least to get down there. I think there is a parking lot. All right, so I have my gun ready. Um, Hopefully the suspect is not gonna start shooting like crazy. Oh, I spot him, I spot him. Oh, he killed that person already. All right, hopefully he's gonna cooperate. Come on, just, just cooperate. I'm just gonna take you to the station. Damn, okay, okay, I got you, I got you, I got you. All right. Oh, I actually didn't take no shot this time. All right, what kind of gun he had? He had an AK or something? Anyway, I'm just securing the area. I don't know if he have his homies with him or something like that, I don't know. They gonna spawn over the <laughs> over this guy. All right, so we got the AK as my evidence, which I didn't even do it properly. I just put it in my... <laughs> anyway, I'm just removing it. All right, so I don't know if they gonna pick up that body they spawn over though. All right, y'all gonna pick up that body too? Oh, did they just hit each other? All right, they got him. Can I arrest her? Damn, she hit herself <laughs> with that door. All right, so let's get back to our vehicle and we'll see how this is gonna turn out. I don't know what kind of calls we um we gonna get, but this is definitely done. Um, we took care of the suspect. This is a code four right now, and we are showing ourselves back in service. All right, and tell me these um, freaking vehicles don't look nice, man. I just started playing with them and they definitely look decent. Kidnapping in progress. Uh, should I use that? Nah. So let's just cruise around, see what we could get into. This is just a qu not so quiet. I was gonna say this is just a quiet night. Not so quiet, but you know, just. Yeah, unable to assist that either. Come on, dude, just stop. Stop. All right, so we are back on patrol. Just showing myself responding until they actually send me this call. So we got an armed suspect in the area of town. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Really, dude? I don't want to back up into this guy. All right. Oh, damn. Y'all didn't see that? This guy just an asshole. Like, he's just an asshole, dude. Like, come on. Should have pulled him over. All right, so we're going for this call right now. Um, hopefully, we won't have to shoot this person again. But where are they? Where are they? Where are they? All right, they're over here. Well, we're here already. Is that them standing over there? 
All right, so we're gonna approach the suspect and hopefully they will cooperate. Oh, there they go. All right, hopefully that suspect is gonna cooperate. Miss? Miss, please don't shoot me. Please don't shoot. Just don't shoot me. I'm giving you a chance. Oh my god. All right. I was gonna give her a chance, but she fired one shot at me anyway. And of course, you know I had to return fire. All right, so I don't know. All my suspects been having AK. I should call this episode like AK RCMP AK 47 episode or something like that. <laughs> All right. Okay, the corner has been working good so far. That's surprising. All right. Okay, so they got the sus. Really, you have to run it. Like, really, lady. All right, so let's get back to. Oh, whoa, I didn't. I didn't see nothing. I, I mean, I didn't hear nothing. Y'all heard that crash and stuff, right? All right. All right. Show me back in service. Um, for both scripts, at least. Um, some of you guys usually ask me about the other script. Oh, we have a breach of peace. All right, let's take that. It's been a while since I did those. Um, yeah. Some of you guys been asking me like, what is um the other callout that I'm using? I found out that police and script and um VP callout work with LCPDFR. So that was that's what that's what I've been using lately. So whoa whoa whoa, y'all didn't see that? So if you have police and script and callout um not callout but <laughs> VP callout I was gonna say callout plus VP callout they actually work perfectly with LCPDFR. Even with 1.1, which amazes me right now. But anyway, let's try to get to the location and to get his breach of peace. I don't know if we're gonna have multiple suspects or maybe one, but with breach of peace, you never know what you're walking into. So it's always amazing though, just to just um just to get there and see how it's gonna turn out. All right, so where are they? See, I'm not even using stolen. my light, right? So we're gonna approach. Where are they? Oh, they right there. They right there. All right. So we just, you know what? Let's just walk toward the suspect. Is that a female? All right. So we can, we're just gonna walk toward the suspect, you know, introduce ourselves as the officers. I'm calling for backup right now, which you guys always say for me to do. 1.1. Backup works perfectly, so this is amazing. Damn, they're using a siren. All right, I hope that ain't scare off. All right, they on their way. Um, should I wait for backup? There's only one suspect. All right, miss, put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Don't do it. Don't do it. Damn, y'all. All right, is there any other suspect around? You know, when there's breach of peace, it might be like. Other suspect around the area. You okay? Damn, freaking dead right now. For no reason. We have a report of a civilian fatality on Columbus Avenue. Alright, damn, okay. Damn. Look how they coming toward my way. Alright, but at least they showing up. Um one thing that 1.1 actually have is um I guess all the updates is is it's easier to actually have backup or call for um you know i just want to make sure like there's no other suspect around here so we're just checking everything right now yeah so when you call for backup oh police and script just crash i think be uh, because i didn't complete the call all right before the coroner actually took the um body yeah i mean that's one thing that i mean as far as you know what crash your game, you won't have no problem. That's that's how I'm able to get the game to run so for so long without no problem. If when you're playing and the game crash and then you just restart it without trying to find out, oh what what crashed my game? It won't I mean it's just gonna keep crashing the same way again, or whenever that situation happened, it's just gonna crash again. But if you take your time and actually look at the log file and just review whatever all right, me and Fancon was just talking about that stolen vehicle. Nah, uh, me and Fancon was just talking about that. How you should know how to l read the log file, and it will it would actually point out exactly. I need a unit for a mugging. On a mugging? Yeah, I'm not answering those calls. 
to officer in trouble all right let me pick that up you see the unit behind me all right so i just picked up a call for an officer in trouble they should be sending me the location anytime now yeah so if you actually take your time to actually view uh, the log file and oh i just respond now i thought i responded a long time ago the officer in trouble oh, it was right behind us all right so let me just back up you drive reckless man all right so i was trying to rush to these cars because it depends on how long it takes us to get to the car before the act the officer actually gets shot all right you see right now he's in the open why are you not taking cover with a guy with an ak like come on you see i'm blocking him right now just at least oh he took a couple shots i gotta cover myself too but at least i'm gonna get this guy I got him. I got him. Is the officer still standing though? Right, I got I got the suspect. Is he still? Oh, okay, he's still alive. You see, we just saved his life right now. If we came like probably a couple seconds later, he would have been dead right now. Oh, I thought he was playing dead for a second. All right, so um, we did save his life or whatever. An officer. I don't want to respond that call be only because that's one call that is known to crash the game. And I know it's probably not fixed yet, so I really don't want to try it. All right, so we got the corner here. Um, they pick, they should be picking up both bodies or whatever. And we did just save this guy life, and yeah, from a gunshot wound. Of course he did. All right, so this officer should be able to take care of the rest of these stuff. I don't know. We got the body out of here already. Okay, the body's out of here. Um, officer, you should be good, man. Just get out of here. Don't like protect. Like, come on, take cover next time. He didn't even take no cover. Like, he was just standing there. Like, at least hide by the trees or something. Or use your car. I don't know if they they probably rushed them. What the hell? Hey, there's no like nobody walk around here. All right, just kind of a suspect right now. I don't know. We just had a crazy shootout and we spot somebody around the area you better stop miss you better stop all right so i'm just checking out just making sure she doesn't have a weapon or anything like that you know we just came we just came from a shootout and she happened to be around the area too i don't know i just don't trust her right now so just making sure she doesn't have any weapons and we're gonna give um check her id if anything don't come up we're just gonna drive her out of here because nobody should be around this area right now a robbery at gunpoint yeah i'm busy right now <laughs> all right miss grizzle um we're just gonna um call dispatch just to make sure i mean miss um <laughs> right now. we're just gonna check with dispatch no, I'm not answering that right now. Just give me um zero citation about driver license, no active warrant. All right, so you know what? We're just gonna detain her just to put. We're just gonna put her in our vehicle, just drive her out of here, and let her go free after we get out this area. Report of a broken down vehicle. Um, I haven't did a call like that for a while. All right, so let's drive her out of here. That officer is still down there. Nah, I thought that would have worked. Um, there's like an option now once you have like the driver. Let's say if you you're doing a traffic stop, right? And you pull over the driver and you feel like you need to talk to him or whatever, you could just bring him to your vehicle and have a talk with him. We could we could I mean you could just put him in the back seat and talk to him, you know, question the guy or whatever. But anyway, we're just gonna let her out and we just going back on patrol. I might switch up the car, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe the Crown Vic. I haven't used it. Thanks for your cooperation. You can go. All right, so we just switched up to the Crown Vic. Um, I've been following this guy, and he decided that he took a red light back there. Is he gonna take this red light too? No, it turned green. All right, so anyway, we're just gonna do a regular traffic stop on this guy. So I'm just probably just gonna light him up. I don't know. He's just he's just suspicious right now. I mean, he just looks suspicious right now. I don't pay citation. Why not? You know what? I'm just going to let him go. All right, so we got a suspect with a um, pay citation. He just got lucky, though. Oh, it looked like the same car, though. LCPD, pull over. 
All right, so the suspect is definitely pulling over right now. Come on, just pull over. All right, there's no flag on his car or anything like that, so this is gonna be a regular traffic stop. But anyway, this might be my last traffic stop or whatever. And you know what? I might just give this guy a ticket and we should be out of here. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode or whatever. And yeah, I might try some something I guess something different with our CMP again. And wow, I'm up to like what 40 minutes already? So hopefully you guys definitely gonna enjoy this. Um yeah, I was drinking my coffee, don't mind me. Stop running and get on the ground. Oh my he's running. Aw oh, damn. Alright, let's let's call for backup. Damn. Alright, this this was supposed to be my last call. I'm just going off shift, man. Alright, so one thing I haven't used for a while, let's call the helicopter too. Like we're gonna call everybody right now. Except for the news. That's the only thing I'm not calling right now, but let's call we gonna we call for backup already. Come on dude, just pull over. Maybe he might crash. Come on. All right, I was waiting to back up catch up to me, but where are they? All right, I see one vehicle catching up to me. Yeah, I'm getting air support too, just to make sure I don't lose him. So we get air support too. Backup is right behind me, so I have at least a unit behind me. All right, the helicopter should be here any second from now. I got one unit. Okay, I got two unit behind me. All right, sir, you better stop. You better cooperate, or these guys will get you. All right, the helicopter is on the scene already. All right, so the, the helicopter should be catching up now. Okay, I guess you want to be primary? Damn, okay, guys. I thought I was primary. All right, these guys taking, okay, okay. All right, they flipped the car, okay. That works, right? And the helicopter is already, already um, spot this guy, so. Hopefully this is the end of this um cra um I'm saying crash. This is the end the end of this chase at least. All right. Hopefully this guy's not gonna try to. Are you trying to run right now? Oh, okay. Okay. So they got him. Um. Yeah. I guess this is about it for now. Um. We up to like what forty something minute. Hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this episode. This is our second episode of RCMP. I got a 1990 episode coming up. I got some more. Oh, I actually found a new Artima. I can't wait to use it in an episode. So there's a lot of new videos that I have coming your way. So definitely be on the lookout for that. I got some free time or whatever. But once again, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Until next time.